All right, y'all, let's go ahead and talk about it. I've been getting a lot of downloads today when I tell you. I feel like some of y'all are dealing with somebody or what used to deal with somebody. Somebody watching y'all from a fake page, okay? Somebody is literally watching y'all from a fake ass page, okay? They could be liking your stuff, like old pictures and stuff to try to get you to look back at the time that you and them were like together or around each other. <coughs> Excuse me. Or around each other for a reason. This person is trying to manifest you back into their life. Okay, so let's jump. Oh, let's jump into it. This just flew out, okay? Yes, this person, you've been on this person's mind, okay? You have been on this person's mind. You have been on this person's mind heavily. Yep. They've been thinking about y'all being together, getting back together. Okay, two of cups. They've been thinking about y'all getting back together. Yep, Hierophant, six of cups. And the Knight of Wands. This person real flighty. They're very in and out. They're very inconsistent. They want to come around you. They want to be up under you. They try to get you to change your mind. This person definitely wants this connection back. It could be a Virgo. It could be any sign, but I'm picking up on Virgo. But they've been thinking about you a lot lately. Yeah, they got an offer that they want to give you. We got the will. Okay, so this they're saying, look, this is their chance. They're trying to get another opportunity with you. This could be a King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Male. This this masculine says they they had maybe they had a few options at the time and it was very uncertain on what to do, but they are trying to manifest their way back into your life. They feel like you deserve more than what they could give you at the time. So they checked out of the connection. Somebody also had kind of like low self-esteem. This masculine had low self-esteem. Could be a Scorpio. They've been thinking about you. They're still holding on to you. They want to come back. They left on a bad note. Okay, so somebody said that they were pregnant. I'm putting that out there because this is what it looks like. It looks like this person was initially supposed to leave you for good because they could have somebody told them that they were pregnant okay so maybe they had like a baby on the way um but they didn't know how to tell you they didn't know how you was gonna take that okay so i'm hearing started cheating on each other or started disrespecting each other yeah, very much so started disrespecting each other. But this person has been spying on you. They've been spying on you. They regret how they treated you. They treated you bad. They real deal treated you bad. They want to talk to you, try to like clear their name. They want to clear their name. This person was going back and forth between you and somebody else. They were like in two relationships at the same time. Wow. Okay. Let's get a little bit more tea. Then we're going to grab some oracles. Ten of swords. This person stabbed you in the back. They did you wrong. Yeah, they did you wrong. They, but they're saying, look, I can't wait to hug you again. I can't wait to be around you again. Can't wait to see you. I love you again. This person is real deal struggling with these thoughts, okay? They're in nine of swords energy. They don't know how you're going to act, how you're going to respond, because it's been so long.
So they don't know how you're going to take it. But they're very regretful. They regret lying to you. Ooh. They treated you bad. When I say bad, five of swords, seven of swords, they regret playing these mind games with you. They try to put you in some type of little mind game. They regret manipulating you. It could have been children involved. I'm here and cheated on each other. Or they know that they have to end a situation with a third party. But I'm getting that. It was a sad ending. Like the way it ended was hurtful. Now we got the Queen of Wands and the strength here. It could be a Leo Sagittarius Aries here that they could be dealing with. I'm here and missed the point though. I'm here and told you to wait. But instead, you you popped up anyway. What would make you do that? You feel like you can can deal with the situation. Okay, so yeah, this person this person got a lot to say. But I'm not going to dig in too much into that just yet. But this person got a lot that they want to say. So before we go... Let's jump into these. Let's see what they want to say. What do they want to say? I can't stop thinking about you. I knew it. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. This person, you've been on this person mind real heavy real heavy okay i feel like maybe the time was off between you guys it just wasn't a good time i regret lying to you see you don't know how hard it was to let you go it wasn't easy for you for this person is to disconnect from you but they lied okay i feel you leaving me behind so see <laughs> see this person felt like they they that you deserve better but they, this person does love you unconditionally, but they're just afraid to reach out to you right now. They're kind of trying to, like, let you heal, but they can't stop thinking about you. They regret lying to you, and they feel like you are just kind of, like, letting the situation go, letting it be. If it's meant to be, it'll be. But this person is snooping on you, snooping on you from um, another page, okay? They're snooping on you from another page. Now... The reason that they're looking on you from another page is because they could, like I said, they could be sitting there reminiscing, looking at old things when you two were together, looking at how happy you were when y'all were together, looking at all the memories. And it's kind of how this person in a place where they're nostalgic, okay? They let, they, they let their pride and ego get in the way. But they've been getting all the signs. Spirit been working with this person. And they're, they're trying to under... I told you. Didn't I tell you? See the signs. See the signs. Understand. Okay? This person is afraid to come towards you right now. They're not sure how to come towards you. So they're seeing if you're catching on to the signs. Okay, they're throwing out signs. I'm telling you, this person is throwing out these signs of like, remember, do you remember the time we fell in love? Do you remember the time when we first met, girl? Oh, I. <laughs> they on their Michael Jackson shit right now. This person say, put your pride and ego to the side, right, queen? Do you see the signs? Are you catching on to the signs? I'm scared to come towards you. Okay, I don't know what to say. What am I? What What am I supposed to say? If you give me a sign and show me that it's okay, then I'm gonna come towards you. See, they are trying to also figure out if you're in a connection or not. See, didn't I tell you? Awakening, contemplation, and return. Self-worth. This person has birth. They feel like they've done the work on themselves. Because I feel like the person that you were dealing with may have had a little bit of self-esteem issue. But they say, look, I'm better now. And I've been thinking about you. I've been thinking about coming back. You know, I'm, I'm better. I've been thinking about, you know, I need you in my life. I need you. <laughs> so, they're listening to their spirit guides. Okay, their spirit guides. Um, 
Look at this. They were a mess, and that's why the connection fell apart. They're trying to find their way back to you. Gotta find my way back, way back to you, baby. Trying to find my way back, way back to you, baby. They said they're going to find their way back to you. They were a mess, and they regretted it. That's why I fell apart because they was being fake. They weren't being their authentic self. Okay. So this is a cycle. This is something, a habit or something that they they know that they needed to break. They said by this summer, they admire your your free will, like how you maneuver, how you think, how you move. They admire that about you. They admire that about you. I feel like this summer, this person is going to have enough confidence to surrender. Okay, we got surrender and regret. And they're regretting what they did and how they treated you. They're coming with an offer. I feel like this offer is going to be better than the last offer. Okay, nostalgia. This person is going to come with some type of real commitment, a ring, a level up in the connection. They want more. They want to vibe higher with you. Okay, and instead of them sitting around playing the victim in the situation, I feel like they're looking at the part that they play and they're telling they they want to say that they learned their lesson. Okay, but this person is getting ready to surrender very soon. Okay, it's like they can't take it no more. Grief, yep. Yeah. This person has been in grief. Okay, ever since you two have not been together, this person has been in nothing but grief. Okay, and see, they're just trying to refocus. They're, they're, you taught this person a lot. Okay, they know that they need to focus on focus on themselves. And they, they said, look, I've done the work on myself. I'm ready to come back. I'm ready to come back. I've been thinking about you. I've been thinking about you. You've been on my mind every day when I wake up. I want to reach out to you. I want to communicate with you. I want to see what you got going on. Because I know I abandoned the connection. I abandoned this connection and I took a different route. I did something completely different. But that situation ain't do nothing but have me stuck. I ain't been nothing but stuck since me and you ain't been together. Please forgive me. That's what I got y'all. This person said they're trying to find their way back. Okay, they're trying to find their way back. How do I get this connection back together? They're trying to give you the signs. Okay, they're saying that, look, pay attention to the signs, please. I'm watching you. I'm watching you from a different page. But please pay attention to the signs. Do you understand the signs that I'm giving you? Do Are you paying attention? But see, they letting their pride and ego. This is something that they need to let go of. Okay. They need to just come on out and be a man and just speak how they truly feel. They playing all these mind games and all that. Like, mm, just come on out and just speak how you feel. Okay. So that's what I got y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. As well, if you are new to my channel, guys, be sure to hit the subscribe button. You're not going to want to miss out on future videos. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.